Hey guys, welcome to a P3D video, and uh, in this video we're going to talk about, or not talk about, show you how to get HD displays uh, with the Quality Wing 787. Uh, this works the Dash 8 and the Dash 9, um, but when you edit it, you only edit the Dash 8 and it will, and it will convert over to the Dash 9 as well. Uh, so make sure you don't edit the Dash 9, otherwise the Dash 9 will not come up. Uh, I'll show you what I mean by that when we get to the editing part of it. So you can see here, we have HD displays. If I really get up to this, you can tell that like HD. Um, you'll really see the difference when we load back into uh, the old one and uh, I'll show you how to change over. Uh, so yeah, this is what the HD displays look like on everything. Uh, they look absolutely amazing. Um, and yeah, let's go show you how to do it. So, first of all, the sim must be shut down uh, so exit out of P3D and you'll literally have to go to your main P3D folder okay it's my main P3D folder and you go to P3D and you scroll down to sim objects like so obviously it's an aircraft so it goes to airplane section and it's a it starts with Q, so it's all the way down here, the quality wings just below PMDG. And like I said, do not edit dash 9. It's just the dash 8. Um, so right now, I need to change these, because um, they're not going to be the same as you guys. Uh, so you have these named like this. There we go. You have a panel, a panel dot high res, and a panel dot low vas. Okay? So for those of you who want to low vas panels, then you can change the name of this one to just panel like this one but before you do that you'll change this one to uh, a different name so what I normally do is I have this at standard uh, ST no, I just need to add panel to it first <laughs> STD there we go and but I want the high res ones these are the, the HD ones um, so what I want is to rename this one just to panel like so and now that is the active panel. The sim does not read these two, so don't worry about whatever you name these. The sim does not read these. Um, so, for example, if you wanted the panel low vas, you would rename that folder to just panel. But make sure you change the one that is just panel before to a different name because you want these to stay as uh, as backups. So now, if you've re renamed it to the low vas one or the high res one, just to panel, you're all set. If we go to the airplanes. 787-9 it still has the panel high res and low vas um, but don't worry about that I don't know why that has it in there but that really does not matter at all um, and that is literally how you get the HD um, displays right what's going to cut up on screen now is pretty much a two photos showing the low res ones and the high res ones and you, and you can really see the difference um, so if you have the 787 in P3D I'm not sure if I'm not sure if it's P3D only or and it works with FSX. I'm not not really sure on that because I only have P3D. I know it works with P3D. So as you can see, the low res panel is just absolute crap. And then once you switch over to the high res panel, it looks so much better. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy this little tweak. This is literally by Quality Wings. This little tweak, which is awesome. So do not be scared to do it. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.